Wildfires have raged in California for days now, which begs the question, why is the air in northern Utah so smoky today? Well, the answer, Bob, is pretty simple, but predicting it in advance is less so. Fox 13's Max Roth joins us with a look at a Utah professor trying to help with that. Max. Yeah, Kelly and Bob, you know, Derek Malia is a research professor at the U, and he is building a model to show where fires themselves and the smoke they create will go. California is suffering the most. Lightning sparked fires eating up almost 500,000 acres so far, destroying more than 500 homes, more than 70,000 people evacuated, and at least four people dead. Professor Derek Malia wants to help firefighters on the ground. It's a model that can actually forecast fire growth. This map shows wildfires across the West. The red dots are the biggest, then the blue, then the black. And you see Utah's directly west of most of the big fires. Malia's computer model can also help predict the dangerous secondary threat, the one that just obscured the sun over much of Utah. We can make a forecast on what the smoke will look like the next day. Will it be really smoky? Um, will it be no smoke? Um, our model has the ability of kind of predicting that. Smoke looks like a cloud, but it's really an intruder. Particulates pushing into weather patterns, and sometimes they push back. And that's what helped us until this day. But what this high pressure system has been doing is it's been deflecting the smoke up into Idaho and up around Wyoming and down back into Denver. And so it's been kind of shielding Utah. In other words, that string of triple digit days kind of helped. If you look at the satellite image for today, you can see that that ridge is no longer kind of in place or that high pressure system is no longer here. And so this has kind of allowed the smoke to kind of filter in now. Now, Melia has also published research looking at the difference between the behavior of wildfires in forests and grasslands, also trying to predict fire behavior and the extent and the spread of smoke. Live in the newsroom, Max Roth, Fox 13 News, Utah.